Hey there, thank you so much for coming back to join me for this week's hair care review. So today I have three different um, sulfate free shampoos that I've been using a lot and I definitely recommend them and I wanted to share with you what those are and why I recommend them. So if you'd like to see my three picks that I'm using right now and why I like them so much and why you should pick them up, then please keep on watching. Obviously, these are all drugstore. Um, I do have a few higher-end sulfate-free shampoos and conditioners, but these are all drugstore. So I'm going to go ahead and start with the most expensive, expensive of the drugstore, and it is the Pantene Illuminating Color Care with Biotin, um, sulfate-free. Um, so yeah, so this is sulfate-free shampoo with nourishing protection for brilliant color, rich moisture. So I actually got this a little while ago from Amazon. Uh, you only get 9.6 fluid ounces in the shampoo and 8 fluid ounces in the conditioner, but um, enjoy the crisp, lively fragrance and the rich lather of this nutrient-infused, sulfate-free shampoo with a blend of pro vitamin B5, antioxidant, and biotin. Gentle formula leaves colored hair looking radiant. Um, so I do use sulfate-free more than I use sulfate. I have a handful, maybe five. Um, sulfate shampoos just because I'm trying to be a little bit more gentle with my hair. It has grown and I also feel like it has thickened up a little bit. I mean I still have some pretty thin areas but I definitely feel like it's thickened up and I do feel like using sulfate free products um, is definitely helping with that. So I really do like this stuff. This is the one I'm going to be using tonight with y'all but I just wanted to sh kind of read about it but this stuff does lather very nicely. It does smell really good even though like the newer Pantene stuff is a little bit more expensive, I do like it and I do think it's worth it. So I do like this a lot. If you are a Pantene lover, then I would definitely look at their sulfate free lines. Uh, this is one of many of the sulfate free, just FYI. Um, okay, next, um, this is the second most expensive. This stuff is amazing though. This is the Garnier Whole Blends Taming Shampoo, sulfate free remedy. Blended without sulfates, parabens, mineral oil, or gluten. Oh my goodness. I love Garnier. I think that they have really, really good stuff. Um, I wish that they made more sulfate-free products, but this tames and smooths very frizzy. Um, this stuff is extremely moisturizing. I do have a coconut leave-in conditioner that I'll actually use with this because it is Garnier and it's like tame like taming, frizziness, all that kind of stuff, but this stuff is so, so good. It smells really good. This is 12 ounces. I do like that it comes with a pump, but anyway, so it's sulfate-free. It has coconut oil and cocoa butter. It's a uh, potent yet gentle remedy for very frizzy hair. Um, expertly blend sustainable source coconut oil and cocoa butter in a powerful, enriching, sulfate-free recipe, but yeah, um, I like that it has like no gluten, no mineral oil, because some people are still sensitive to that. You know, just because sulfate-free products works for my hair doesn't mean it's going to work for everyone's hair. Some people maybe can't use silicones or uh, mineral oils, petroleum, stuff like that. So I do like that it does seem like drugstore shampoos and conditioners. They are a little bit more, um, you can easily tell like from the front whether or not something has something or doesn't have something. Not all brands are like that, obviously. Um, I know for a long time I had to like research stuff and like, okay, what can it be called on the back of a package? So it is kind of nice when it's like, oh, there's no gluten, no mineral oil, but this stuff is really, really good. It smells amazing, amazing, lathers very nicely, and it's just such a good shampoo. Um, for me, this is personally, even when I had longer hair, this stuff is uh, conditioner optional just because... Um, it is that moisturizing. I do have combo hair when it's long. So but this stuff is really, really good. If you do like the Garnier Whole Bloods line, definitely recommend looking into this. It's amazing. So, so good. Okay. The last one I wanted to talk about, y'all already know how much I love this and I really wish I was going to use this tonight, but I just recently used it. It's the Suave Smooth Performer Shampoo and Conditioner. Of course, Suave, super affordable, but this is sulfate free has amino acid complex, cleanse and smooths for workable smooth hair. Um, yeah, this stuff is so, so good. Suave, I feel like if you were a poorer kid, poor teenager, adult, whatever, back in the 80s and 90s, 
Suave kind of and White Rain. Suave and White Rain were kind of like the go-tos back in the day if you were poor because it was super affordable. Um, it smelled really good. Might have not been like the most amazing for dry hair, but it was still a really, really good product. But I love that they have come out with a more broad line of products. So I love that they do have sulfate-free shampoos and conditioners. But this stuff really does do an amazing job of smoothing your hair. If you have rough, flyaway, you know, frizzy type of hair, the Smooth Performer from Suave is absolutely incredible. Honestly, this is probably, these are probably my top five shampoos over all, over like sulfate, sulfate free, high end, doesn't matter. This stuff is just so good. I would repurchase this over and over and over again. That is how much I do like these. They are just amazing. So yes, if you like Suave, if you're looking for something that's extremely affordable, but still sulfate free, I would definitely recommend the Suave Smooth Performer. Once again, kind of like the Pantene. I know that they do have multiple different types of sulfate-free lines within the Suave collection, but it's so, so good. Love this stuff. Oh, it's amazing, so amazing. And I've talked about that stuff a lot. It's great. But let me go ahead and get on with shampooing and conditioning my hair with the Pantene Illuminating Color Care. We'll do that. But there we go, hair is very smooth, it smells so good. Still a little bit of hair fallout, which we might get be getting to that point where it's normal. But those were the three sulfate-free shampoos and a couple of conditioners that I've been really enjoying right now. I'm planning on doing these like maybe once a month, like tell you about the ones that I'm really enjoying. Maybe ones that I've like revisited, I'm like, nah, I'm not really enjoying it. But those are the three for this month. Um, I hope you did enjoy this week's uh, hair care video. If you did, if you want to give the video a thumbs up, share it, all that kind of stuff. Let me know down below in the comments. What are you, What is your go-to sulfate-free shampoo and conditioner? I would love to know down below. And I appreciate you stopping by. Another video should start out of playing here in a moment. It might be one of mine. It might be somebody else's. But sit back, relax, enjoy. I'll see you all here in just a second. 